<laughs> oh wow, okay, that was tense. Uh, run, 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 run. Oh, what? <laughs> wow! What a cheap shot. <laughs> All right, here we are with more Mega Man Maker. Uh, today we will be playing through Bomberman and his adoring fans number three, created by Bolt Graving. As you can see, I've already would up the stage and it has 16 players and a score of negative 2. Oh. And yeah, um. Yeah, so I did start up the level and I did get like uh, 30 screens or something in. And yeah, the stage is very laggy. <laughs> very laggy on my computer at least. Um, it's really laggy and the stage is pretty long and like I just kept dying and I got frustrated uh, so <laughs> I decided to start over because the video was like 30 minutes long and I have not made any progress in the stage um, so yeah um, mainly the main problem that I had was like I did not know how the checkpoints in this level worked um, but I did find out um, after I came back to the level Oops. <laughs> I did find out how you're supposed to access the checkpoints and like I tried to do this stage first without any of the checkpoints and it was like yeah that was hell <laughs> that was just hell and yeah we lose our crash bombs there <clears throat> so we definitely just are just going to have to do some dodging here oops <laughs> that just clipped my toe that freaking bullet <laughs> um, yeah, so let's just lure these guys. Ah, wait, let me try that again. Do that. I think we can just do this, yeah. Run by him. And yeah, this is here, this here is what I talk about. Like, it looks like you will die when you take that checkpoint. So naturally, I did not bother with the checkpoints. You know, I just went here and, you know, went through here. And, you know, I never got the checkpoints because it looks like you will die. And, you know, if you... If you enter the door there, and you don't have the key, you will be soft. <laughs> so yeah, I thought that was just, you know, there to taunt the player. So that's why I never went for it. And, you know, I kept playing this stage for like half an hour. And I just kept dying. And it got very frustrating. And see, like that. <laughs> the lag killed me, and I did not get the checkpoint. Um, just to uh, show, how, show how it works. So yeah, I'm, I'm going to cut back to where I just died. So see you in a sec. All right, so we're back. I took some damage from the shots so there in the beginning, but yeah, nothing too bad. So now uh, let's just show this off. Like, if you just have faith, you know, if you just have faith, um, you will get the checkpoint. Sure, you will die, but like, you will spawn here with the key, and yeah, on the spikes you get the invulnerability frames. Uh, so like. I just really wish this checkpoint system was made better, like, it really, it really wasn't fun <laughs> playing through here the first time, like, when I did not know how it worked, it was very confusing, and like, I just, you know, I just kept playing this stage without a checkpoint for a whole, you know, half hour, and like, I kept dying to these little lag spikes that we have everywhere, and you know, I just, yeah, it was not a good time, <laughs> um, it was not a good time indeed. But yeah, now that we have the <clears throat> checkpoints, like, this should be a lot easier than before. A lot more manageable, so, yeah. Uh, I just, yeah, as I already said, I just wish the checkpoint system was made in a clearer way. Yeah, I'm just going to do that there. That is a very tricky jump, and it's right before the checkpoint, so, yeah. I'll definitely <laughs> damage boost. But yeah, okay. But yeah, like... I, I can tell that this is set up this way, you know, just so that the player can, um, you know, choose between doing the whole stage without checkpoints, you know, a hard mode of sorts, which is fine. I just wish that it was easier to tell, like, does there have to be spikes there? Can't you just have a, you know, regular floor down here, you know, you go get the checkpoint and, you know, that's it. And if you don't want it, you can go on the upper path, you know, remove all the doors, remove all the spikes, you know, just make it clearer it's it doesn't <laughs> it doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me to have a spike floor beneath the checkpoint i mean 
you know, it just takes time, you know, when you load in here and yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Let's just try and do this. Yeah, this section is pretty hard. Um, but I have done this section like <laughs> so many times, so I definitely have some experience with it. Um, so yeah, I should be able to do this without dying, and I did. That's very good. Yeah, here we just have to move. It's like very, very close. You can just barely squeeze by these bats here. Just barely. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Super close. But yeah, I mean, and I, you know, I just keep harping on it, but I really wish that the checkpoint uh, system worked differently. Like, it would have been so much more fun to play this if I knew how it worked, you know, right off the bat. It would have been so much more fun instead of, you know, <laughs> having this system here. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, I guess I'll just shut up about that now. I've already made my point. <laughs> okay, now. Finally get our buster here. We have more more fish. I just gotta be careful not to Ooh. Yeah. Just gotta have to take my time with the jumps. Um since it is a little bit laggier for me, I Oh jice shite. Since it is a little bit laggy for me, um I can't just you know run and jump. Um if I do, the lag might eat up an input, you know, and I'll <laughs> just run out of the, you know, right into the pit there. So yeah, that's no good. So this is the best way uh, to do it on my, on my PC. You know, just inch yourself up and jump when it's safe. That's much better. Ah, close. Ooh. <laughs> and I believe we have another checkpoint coming up here. Like, the stage has plenty full of checkpoints. So, thank god for that! <laughs> um, yeah. Once you know how they work, anyway. <laughs> Oops. Oopsie doopsie. Alright, now. Carefully. Grab the ladder and go. You. That fish is pretty easy in this one too. They don't have uh, their hitbox is a little bit uh, smaller than you would think it is. Um, ah, dang, so close! I just need to be a little bit faster there with that second turret. Yeah, yeah, just mash. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, <laughs> be careful now! Don't. Run and jump, the lag might get me. <laughs> and yeah, I have never actually been in this teleporter here. Um, so I don't know what's in there. Hmm. But I would like to rather get the checkpoint than risking my uh, going into the teleporter there. Yeah. Like I've never made it this far, so I don't know. I don't know. I think I'll just, you know, go with the checkpoint. I think that will be the safe bet for me here. Uh, who knows what the, who knows what the teleporter, where it goes. Like it could be some, you know, super duper hard path or something. And geez, I never noticed my buster going. Oh no, there it is. It did not go away. Huh. Oh, yo, kiddo. <laughs> and now we don't get any more ammo. So now I have to be really careful um, when I use it. Okay, so let's not use it at all then. I might need it. If this stage is like, you know, the first... And holy moly, this is very laggy. If this stage is like the first Bomberman and the second Bomberman and his adoring fans, um, I think I know where all the lag is coming from. It's probably from an upcoming section. <laughs> it's probably from an upcoming section. Or like the boss room in the... In the second version of the stage, um, the boss room had like a bazillion bats in it, you know, laying the stage down. Um, and yeah, it is just really hard to play this uh, properly. 
Oh wow, oh, <laughs> the leg almost got me there. But I think I have it. Wow, okay, please don't die now. Uh, very nice, we have some ammo, <laughs> that's nice. Phew. Mm-hmm. Had a similar section in the uh, second version of this stage. I remember you could like either climb up or you could like go into a room where there, you would be locked in and like a ton of monsters would just kill you. I remember that. <laughs> but that might have been taken out. Who knows? Yeah, I believe this is the door that screwed you over and you had like a ladder over here or something. But yeah, hopefully I don't have to fall into one of these pits somewhere along the way, that would be... Yeah, <laughs> thankfully. That would have been really trolly. <laughs> and that ammo was a godsend, that is for damn sure. A damn sure, a damn sure, uh, a sure... A sure thing, whatever. Uh. <laughs> and yeah, sure enough, we have the key here. And I will definitely take the checkpoint because that was a long segment. Better safe than sorry. Okay. Uh, check over here. Let's just. Oh shoot. Run! No, 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 no. Wow, there are so many bats! Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, well. Luckily, they did not stun lock me there. Um, and yeah, these guys take many bullets, so let's just. Let's not even fight them. Just in case we need the ammo here, you know. Just in case, I'd rather be safe than sorry. But here we are going to have to fight a little bit. Oh, what the hell! Ugh! Oh wow, okay, that was tense. <laughs> run, 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 run. Oh, what? <laughs> wow! What a cheap shot. <laughs> wow. Okay then. Well, now I know. <laughs> now, at the very least, I know. Can we just. No, okay, I was going to land there and jump up to get more speed, but yeah. Wasn't fast enough. And can we? No, we can't charge the buster. I guess we don't have to be all that careful with ammo because we do get some um, every time we have to respawn here. So I guess we could just shoot them up. Yeah, it's fine. And all to the right, and I jumped into. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'll just cut back. <laughs> <laughs> See you in a second. Alright, hold to the right. Duh. <laughs> okay. And yeah, like. I wonder if you could, like, accidentally come in here and, like, go up and jump into the room here and then just be soft locked. That would be. <laughs> that would really suck. <laughs> yeah, but I figured the key would be down there, so yeah. Oh, I will definitely do this stage the woozy way. Uh. <laughs> As I've said numerous times by now. Definitely doing it doing it the woos way. And <laughs> Wow, bolt grave. <laughs> oh my goodness, is this a troll level? It kind of feels like a troll level. <laughs> or maybe I'm just have sucky reaction timing. That could be it too. Okay, but more <laughs> more fish jumping. Got a lot of fish on me. And yeah, I believe this is the boss room. I recognize this. This looks very much like the first boss room. Like a ton of bats. And Bomb Man is... Yeah, there he is. And wow. Wow. Talk about a sheep. Sheep shot there. Freaking bats. But yeah, I've beaten this guy before. Um, it wasn't easy. Um, I think I will play this once. And like, um, if I die, well, so be it. Like, this room is very time-consuming, killing Bombman, and I think, like, in the first version, or in the second version, yeah, he only took one damage, and he does that here, too. But, you know, I already beat this boss, like, it's the same thing, more or less, so I think I won't be going for any help, I will just, you know, I'll just fight him like this, and, yeah, if I die, you know, so be it. Oh, 
Yeah, this is a very hard boss room. I feel like there is so much going on here. And <laughs> there are green platforms too. Hey, you know, you score uh, tons of cheap shots. Or not cheap shots, but you know. They will score tons of hits on you. And like, it's so hard to know where Bomb Man is going. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I'm doomed. I think I'm doomed. Where are you, where are you, you little turd sucker? Come here. There we go. Ouch. Okay. What? Oh. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. But yeah, um. I will just. Uh, <laughs> I won't be playing through uh, the whole uh, boss fight there. It's just taking t up too much time. It's like 5 to 10 minutes boss fight. Uh, and it's very frustrating. <laughs> and as I already said, I have been in it before, so I'm not going to bother with it. Um, but yeah, like, uh, honestly, ball craving, I did not have too gr good of a time with this one. Like, if I had just known how the checkpoints worked, like, if you just go... If you go into the editor, uh, I'll see you in a sec. Uh, we will open it up in the editor. Alright, so here we are in the editor. Um, Here is what I feel like would have been a much better idea. Like, instead of doing this, like... Like, is this whole room up here even necessary? Just like... Just like, delete it. Take it away. Doesn't need to be here, I feel like. Whatever, let's just... We will just pretend we deleted it. <laughs> like... Just... Get rid of all of this shite here. Rid of all of it. Boom. Boom. Like, we don't even need a key. We can just... Do whatever like wouldn't it have been just simpler like inst instead of having that whole setup can it just be like a checkpoint there and if you don't want it well just jump up and go on like it's so the way you set it up is so unnecessarily complex like <laughs> like I don't feel like there is a need for it like same here why why is this needed why not why not just do that you know and had a checkpoint here. If you don't want it, you climb down and move on. Like the way the way it is with the spikes. Like in my first recording, I did not realize how it worked. And as I said, I played for thirty minutes, and I just like kept going. You know, I just entered. You know, I took, I grabbed the key, and I went down. You know, through this because this looks like a safe passage. You know, I just thought these were trolling you. Like. That I, you know, I thought I was just going in, go in here with the key and die on this spike. Like, if you at the very least did this, you know, <laughs> you know, so that it looks like you can actually enter it. Like, it's just, I don't know. I think this is kind of stupid. Uh, if I may be very, very harsh with my wording here, I just don't like this at all. Um, you know, it's a neat idea, I think with how you have it, you know, you can have the checkpoint or you can just pass by it without it if you want to make it harder for yourself. I just think you need to make it uh, more self-explainable that you can indeed get it. Like that, if, if, this had, if this had been made better, I would have had a much better time, you know, in my original playthrough than this, you know, on my first one. But I scrapped that video recording because I just got frustrated and angry with the level, you know. It was not a good time at all. Um, so yeah, but now that I play through it, you know, <laughs> with the checkpoints, it was, it felt much better. <laughs> it was much better than before, uh, like a thousand times better. I just wish that, you know, the lag was a little bit less, like maybe if the boss room was a little bit smaller, you know, I, I don't have the best computer and, you know, Mega Man Maker runs very poorly, you know, when you have many enemies, even if you have a decent computer, so like, yeah. Uh, I don't know like it's a neat stage for what it is, but I wish that it was I wish that it wasn't as laggy. I wish that it wasn't 
uh, and I wish that the checkpoint system uh, worked a little bit better. You know, other than that, it was a fun stage, but yeah, <laughs> like, like imagine I, <laughs> I, you know, you start here and I got like, I can't remember how far I got into the stage. I think I made it like somewhere around here, you know, I can't quite recall. I believe the furthest I got was here, you know, with the only the beginning checkpoint, like from here to here, somewhere in this corridor, I just gave up. And this is all the progress I could make in 30 minutes. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, not even 30 screens. <laughs> so yeah, um, I don't know. I don't know, like the, the leg killed me many times in here. And you know, it killed me. I, I didn't damage boost here either in the beginning. I just, you know, went up here and tried to jump and I died a couple times there. Um, I died many times here and you know, I went way back and the few times that I went uh, through it, you know, came down here <laughs> and then died outside here without any of the checkpoints. It was just, it was very hard, very freaking hard. But yeah. um. The one nice thing that I could say, um, I don't remember exactly how the second uh, version of the stage looked, but I think that this one has at least, you know, I think this has been upgraded in the visual department uh, uh, in comparison to the earlier one, but yeah, yeah. Hmm. Well, oh well, um, I wasn't... Uh, <laughs> I wasn't too happy when I played this stage the first time, but now with the checkpoint, it was a lot better. So yeah, um, all in all, a neat stage, as long as you know how the checkpoints work. I just wish there was a proper checkpoint placement system or a, an easier one to understand. And I also wish that you had like reduced all the unnecessary bats in the boss room. It just, it lags the stage down, but yeah, I will just leave it at that. So thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.